welcome back. So today I wanted to show you a bit of my cloth diaper stash like I've promised and you know if you're a cloth diapering mom they're not always all clean at once. So this is the majority. I have them all washed and clean and folded. There's some in the diaper bag, there's some in the change table, there's some in the wet bag. So this is what I have and I can insert pictures in of the ones that I'm missing. There's probably not a lot of different variety. I have a lot of doubles. So I'm just going to get into it and show you what I have. It's a rainy day, the lighting's not very good. And if you see this on my face, I walked into a door this morning. So that's great. And on top of it, I have a sunburn on my face. So let's just see how this is going to turn out. Keep watching. Okay, so let's begin with my fitteds. Right here I have my Kissas fitted by Kissa Loves. I have three mother Mother's Ease fitteds. I have three of them. And here I have very well-loved old school cool fitted. And then with these I have my covers. I have the flip diaper but the fitteds don't fit in the flip diaper, they fit in my Thirsties covers and I have the ones with Velcros and the Rye Snaps and I also have some pre-folds that fit in the fitted diaper and the Thirsties covers. And I have some hemp boosters and some bamboo boosters and I have extra but some of them are folded into the diapers. Here I have my Funky Fluff Lux uh, pocket diaper and inside I have a Thirsty's pre-fold cotton hemp pre-fold and I love this this is one of my favorite diapers and then I have my majority of my stash is Elva pockets I have 32 of them of the Elvas and I have a lot of them that are empty and I just need to get some new inserts to put into them because I'm switching from the charcoal bamboo inserts and the microfiber inserts to all natural cotton and so some of these are stuffed with multiple different things but I have a bunch of more Alvas up here. These ones are stuffed with cotton receiving blankets which I like. And right here, this one was only worn once, but I'm keeping it for the reason that this is um, a size three, sorry, a size three apple cheeks, and it's still really big on my baby, so I'm hoping that it will fit him when he gets even bigger. He's a big baby, but when he gets even bigger. Right here, I have a Thirsties pocket diaper, and it is also stuffed with uh, Thirsties cotton hemp Prefold and I love this print. It's the Happy Camper print. And I also have another pocket diaper like this in the print Aqua. These are both fantastic diapers. So that's pretty much it. So I have a lot more Alva diapers in the dirty diaper bag. That's that's pretty much it. Okay, so I just wanted to show you what some of these Alva pockets are stuffed with. If they're not stuffed with a receiving blanket, this one has two Thirsties cotton hemp inserts. It has two of them. One's the long one. This one actually goes into the pocket diaper. And it came with a microfiber insert, but I like using them better this way in the pocket, Alva pocket. And then this one has a cotton receiving blanket, pad folded, and then it has a bamboo booster. So that's one way I like to use my Alvas. And then this one is with a homemade prefold. Homemade prefold, bamboo booster. No, sorry, this is hemp, hemp booster. And so I just like using it like this, folding it up, works very well. And this one, it's just like a mod podge of diapers because I'm trying to switch everything over to natural before they all, all used to be the same. So this is an easy peasy hemp insert. This is a Mother Ease um, cotton bamboo insert. I'm pretty sure it's ba cotton bamboo, so easy peasy. And now this one is just a homemade 
pre-fold with a hemp booster and this pre-fold is made from a flour sack towel and yeah that's pretty much it I have some other pre-folds um, in my Alba diapers and they're okay. in the wash okay now in this apple cheeks size 3 diaper inside I have a couple homemade inserts and I kind of just didn't know what to do with them at first and this uh, apple cheeks pocket did not come with any inserts so I kind of just fold it up and stuff it in you know it has the envelope pocket and so I will be interested to see how this fits it fits my little guy now but it's kind of big around the leg so I wouldn't trust it like for all day or long periods of time so there you go there you have it guys so that's the majority of my cloth diaper stash and I hope the lighting was good I'm going to take a look at it later one day down the road I'm sure my stash will change it's already changed in the almost 11 months since I've been cloth diapering I didn't cloth diaper with my first child now I've only done it with my second baby and we've been doing it since he was uh, five weeks old. We could have done it sooner, but that's just what worked for us. And I love it. I'm not going to go back. Even if we have another baby, we do plan on getting newborn diapers um, the next time around. So that will be a completely different experience. And we're really excited about that. The most exciting thing that I love about cloth diapering is that I do not have to go out and buy diapers. You know, every couple days I'll do a load of laundry. I did a load of laundry yesterday and my tip that I do, I don't recommend it for everybody if it doesn't work for you, but he has his hanging wet bag. And so when I change him, if his clothes are dirty, I also put his clothes into the dirty diaper bag. I wash all of his things together and I am going to be doing a dirty cloth diaper wash routine and you know sometimes if there's like a couple other things in the washer I will wash it all together. We have enough of our other laundry that we do separate loads but that's what works for us because he honestly at this point doesn't go through a lot of laundry just himself so I'm not going to do a separate load just for his laundry so all of his diapers his wipes everything of his goes into the dirty diaper laundry so there you guys have it I hope you liked this video if you did please give it a thumbs up if you want to see more videos like this please subscribe to my channel and if you have any ideas or tips please leave a comment down below I will um, respond as soon as I can. So there you guys have it. Bye guys.